In this video, we will install Microsoft SQL Server 2017 in Windows Server. We are using Windows Server 2019. Let's go to google.com. To disable the warning, take Server Manager. Click on Local Server. Here you will see IE Enhanced Security Configuration. Click on it, turn off for administrator, all other usage you can keep it on, click OK. Restart the browser, after that IE will work without showing annoying security warnings. And go to Google, search for MSSQL 2017 Express, click on the first link. Uh, we need English version, so click on download. Uh, click save. The download is completed. Open the folder. Go to downloads folder. You will see the SQL Server 2017. Double click on the exe file. There are three options. You can go with the basic or custom for a fresh MS SQL installation. In this case we will go with the custom installation. Click on install. So it is going to download the MS SQL installation files. On SQL Server Installation Center, click on the first option to start the installation. Click on the checkbox, I accept the license terms. Click on next to start the installation. The installation failed with error, restart the computer. We need to restart the server before continuing with MS SQL installation. Click on cancel. Close everything and reboot the server. Let's reconnect to the server. We are back on the server. Go back to the downloads folder. Double click on the MS SQL installer. Click on custom. Click on install. As we done before, click on the first option. Accept the license terms and click on next. Enable use Microsoft update to check for updates. Click on next. On the screen you can select various MS SQL features that you need to install. For this installation we will go with the default features. This is the folder where SQL Server will be installed. Click on next. We will select the name MS SQL Server. Click on next. Click on next. MS SQL offer two authentication method. One is Windows authentication mode. This will allow a Windows user to log into MS SQL. Second authentication method is Mixed mode. A mixed mode authentication allow you to create usage in MS SQL server. This also allow Windows administrative usage to log in. We will use Mixer Mode Authentication. For this you need to enter a password for the default administrative user SA. Click on Next. Terms and Condition. We have to click on Accept. Click on Next. Now it is asking for installing Python. Click Accept. Then Next. Now the installation started. It is showing the progress. Installation is now completed. Click on Close. Now we need install SQL Server Management Tools that will download the SQL Server Management Studio. Click on the download link. Click on save. When the download is finished we can click, uh, click on run to start the installation. Click on install. Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio installation is now completed. We are asked to restart. Click on the restart. This will restart the server. Let's connect back to the server. Click on start. We have SQL Server Management Studio here. Click on it. Click on connect. So we have connected to MySQL server. You can click on databases to the, see the databases. Uh, 